Well, today we're at the Lucas Nationals, Chandler, Arizona, Wild Horse Pass. We're going to have an awesome day today, man. There's all kinds of fun stuff to check out. We're going to do some pit pass stuff. We're going to talk to some people. It should be a good day. Yeah, what's up? We got Miles Cheek. What's up, oh, dude? Yeah. How are you doing, man? Yeah, it's so awesome to see you out here. Finally, we get to meet in person over the last, what, six, eight months that we haven't oh, seen yeah. each other. Yeah, it's been a little while. Sure. Dude, this rig is so sick. So you got the Polaris RS1 now? Yeah, got a debut unit this weekend out of the Luke Soul off road races, so uh, ready to go for fun. Qualified for the two, so. Second, huh? Yeah, ready to turn up on it. Dude, that's cool, and you've only ridden it, what? This is the first time out? Um, This is like my first time like on a Lucas track. Like, I've done right. like a little test at a sprint car thing. It wasn't really like what we needed, but for coming out, just like pretty much out of the box, I don't really know what to expect. We're super happy. With that's it. what I was going to say, dude. Coming out second. Yeah. Qualifying second in a car that's well, basically untold. You know, yeah. like you're coming out, and plus it's it's a car that hasn't really been shown very much in the Lucas series, so yeah. that's cool. So um, let's check it out for sure. You got that nice hoop bumper in the front. Oh yeah, um, Brett from B and D, B and D Fab got that up for us. He did the front bumper and front bars for us. This thing looks really good, man. All holes, A arms, everything. Then I got my dad's tie rod kit and all yeah, the axles. All this, the tie rod kit, the sway bar links. Everything looks so great, man. Oh yeah. The whole car. So who did the the fabrication on it? Uh, my crew chief Tim. He's the one that put everything together. Yeah. He, uh, he does some tweaking on it. So. You got the chrome graphics. Chrome graphics. A little Michaels paint for stickers. Then. Uh, Everyone uh, kind of likes this on the car too. My dad built a little back brace for it because we were worried about ripping the cracking radiators or something for some flex in the chassis. So my dad built this little bar. Up so it just too. stiffens up the chassis. Yeah. That's a pretty cool brace too with all the machine the radiator up just so it's easier for Tim to work on it. How is it looking out the back of the car? I don't look out the back. <laughs> no, we're what a good about answer. The in though, but I've never really ran them. You got a good spotter. Yeah. You yeah, got some good uh, radius rods. Radius rods, axles. You got some clutch work. Oh, yeah. Changing some stuff up for the main. You guys did a really good job, man. Thank you. And how's the how's the cockpit on this compared to the It's to the honestly Corsier? bigger than what you'd think. It's uh, pretty roomy in there. Got my Sparko seat. It does. It looks pretty roomy in here. No, it is for sure. It's not as tight as what you'd think. And you obviously got to have the yellow 957. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thankfully, they, they gave us a one race deal for that so we could run the yellow numbers. That's cool. The wheels and tires are looking sweet. Hey, you guys did a good job. Yeah, here's Nash. Really aggressive here. Time is definitely running out with a couple quarters to go. How do you feel about uh, how the year's been going? Um, we've had some our ups and downs. Like we've had some bad races, but we also had some really good races at Crandon. We won the championship there, so that was such a sick event. Yeah, especially for just like the 50th and 50th, all the stuff that's everything. going on. Polaris, they they um, Polaris and Walker, they both put on like a bunch of money. Yeah. For, for the event, so it was pretty cool to win that for them. And um, but in the point series, we've just been a little bit of bad luck every once in a while. Some overheating stuff and. This little stuff that'll take us out of the race, so we're yeah. And it, well, it's good though that you're you have a, a good mindset to just kind of keep the the progress going. You're gonna make sure that you get the new car dialed in the last race of the year. Yeah, exactly. Try to get a head start, see where it actually stands with everyone. So that's pretty rad, man. Yeah, we're really excited. Well, the real question is, what are you cooking later? <laughs> we got some chicken tacos going down tonight. Uh oh, chicken tacos. All right, oh, bud. Yeah. Thanks, man. Oh Appreciate yeah, anytime. It.
Thank you guys for coming by.